A neutron star is the densest body we know of in astrophysics besides a black hole. So if you somehow had a little stone-sized piece of neutron star matter, it would weigh 100 million metric tons and it would immediately fall right through your hand. Because the neutron star is so dense, it generates an intense gravitational field. It is really hard to exaggerate how dramatic and dangerous a neutron star is. The gravity is so intense, it would actually bend light around it. You would see all these kind of weird shimmering effects. Dazzling, but deadly. No astronaut will ever be able to approach a neutron star. But if you're an armchair traveler and want to find out what would happen, let's send a galactic crash test dummy We'll call him Chuck. As Chuck nears the neutron star, its gravitational grip is doing very bad things. The gravity is pulling on him so hard that he is accelerating all the way down to the surface. He'll be moving at very roughly one half to two thirds of the speed of light. The neutron star's gravity is 200 billion times stronger than on Earth. Around 150 miles above the surface, it starts to pull on Chuck's limbs in a distinctly unpleasant way. As you get closer and closer to a neutron star, we were told to think that it would be this elegant spaghettification where you would get longer like a piece of spaghetti. But in reality, you're going to get ripped shreds. Think about what you're really going to experience. Think about, first, all your joints dislocated in your body your skin getting ripped off of your body, your bones being pulled apart, your organs being pulled apart. Within a blink of an eye, our dummy is just a thin stream of atoms hurtling towards the star. Those atoms will eventually fall down onto the neutron star. And unfortunately, the violence doesn't stop there. What's left of Chuck hits the surface, triggering a huge burst of energy. So we're talking about 100,000 miles per second. That's an impact. He's going to hit so hard that the amount of energy released is just huge. It would completely dwarf the entire arsenal of nuclear weapons on our planet. Anything and anyone that ventures too close to a neutron star is destined for this catastrophic end.